This week is a battle between the grade school sizes, the women with the newest kicks actually, and then the men who got some really dope retros. Let's start the show. <laughs> Welcome to the Heat Check. I am your host, Jacques Slade, and this week actually kicks off with Nike Basketball giving us the KD-10 in the turquoise colorway. This is easily one of the brightest KDs I have seen so far this year, and it also has some writing on the tongue. I'm not exactly sure what it says, but if you know, let us know down in the comments below. Also, you can grab those for $150 right now over at Finish Line. Jumping ahead to tomorrow, which has really the most shoes dropping. First, we start with the Adidas Alpha Beyond. These are dropping in two different colorways, and Adidas is doing really good with the Alpha Beyond line. Those will cost you $100. Staying with the three stripes, we have the women's Adidas Alpha Bounce 2. Now, this is a women's colorway and it's E-Crew. I'm not sure that's exactly a color, but those will cost you $100 over at Finish Line as well. Uh, sticking with the women, they get the newest model of the weekend with the Adidas Arkin. These are dropping in three colorways and I really like the way that this shoe looks. I kind of wish they came in the men's sizes. You can get those in white, core black, or raw steel and those are going to cost you $140. All right, jumping over to the sportswear side, we have the Nike Air Max 98 dropping in what is being called the Tidal Wave colorway. These are obviously celebrating their 20th anniversary this year, and you can grab those for $160 over at Finish Line. All right, if you like the Nike Free Run, there are a few versions of this shoe dropping tomorrow that include the 2018, the Free Run Motion Flying at 2018, and the regular Run Flying at 2018. These are all dropping in both men's and women's colorways, and the standout is probably the Free Run 2018 in the t-shirt colorway. Definitely a different look for the sneaker. If you want something a little more forward looking, you can try out the Free Run Motion Flying It, which has definitely caught my eye on more than one occasion. Those will cost you 150. And if you want the regular Nike Free Run in the t-shirt colorway, or just the regular Nike Free Run it, those will cost you $120. On the Puma side of things, it looks like this week is getting a lot of love with the basket sneaker. There is the Heart Coach version, there is the Heart Hyper and Boss version, and then there is the Heart Platform version of the sneaker as well. Prices range from the trio from $90 to $120. You can grab them over at Finish Line. If you'd rather go with something a little more classic that has a bit of flair to it, the Puma Suede Classic Embroidered will be dropping in a white or a black colorway, and you can grab those for $80. And rounding out the drops for Thursday is the Reebok Freestyle High. That one's going to be dropping in two colorways in the chalk version and a green version and those will cost you 105 dollars all right so earlier last week i gave you guys a look at the nike air vapor max plus and now it looks like both the men and the women are going to get their own versions of the shoe on friday or i should say get their own colorways of the hybrid sneaker i really like the way that these look you can grab those for 190 dollars Jumping back over to the basketball side of things, we have the Nike PG2 sneaker dropping in a platinum colorway. This shoe is really nice when it comes to the on-court feel, so if you haven't gotten a pair yet, I definitely recommend you give them a try. Those will cost you 110. For the ladies, Nike Sportswear is dropping the ones reimagined in several different styles and colors. This version of the launch is a lot more colorful than the last one that we saw, and the prices range from $120 all the way up to $160, depending on the style. And speaking of style, the Nike Vapor Street is dropping in a sale and in the medium olive color. Colorway. This is the street version of the Nike Zoom Vapor and has its own unique look. You can look for those that cost you $180. Now, Saturday has a few sneakers lined up for you guys as well. So let's start with the grade school crowd who was getting the Air Jordan 11 Retro in a very cool colorway. This model has a black upper and it looks like a bleached coral accent is what give this model its charm. Those will cost you 130. Sticking with Jordan, we also get the Air Jordan 32 in the stealth colorway. Now, this is a modified version of the Air Jordan 32 as you can tell by the heel there. Plus this one has a few Easter eggs that I think you'll really, really like. Those will cost you 185. For the final Jordan release of the weekend, we have the Air Jordan 18 in the red or Raging Bull colorway. For those of you out there that know your history, the Air Jordan 18 is the last signature shoe that Jordan played in. Those will cost you $225. On the old school side of things, Nike is bringing back the Air Maestro 2 in a limited rush orange colorway. Those will cost you $115 and you can grab those over at Finish Line. All right, and rounding things out this week is the Nike Zoom Fly, which is the regular running version of the Vapor Street that I showed you guys earlier. This one is going to be dropping in the Obsidian colorway and those will cost you $150 over at finish line. All right, so that's gonna do it for the show today. As always, just wanted to cover the things that I thought you guys would definitely be interested in. Uh, make sure you check out down below for find out more information about all the sneakers that I talked about in the video today. I am your host, Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line. And as always, guys, I appreciate you. I'll see you soon. Peace.